Yes, students, welcome back into my another lecture. We are discussing the uh, physics numerical part, okay, for the CSE stream students. I have taken the question from June, July 2023 paper, okay. This is question number 3C. A particle of mass 0 0.5 mega electron volt per uh, velocity of light whole square has kinetic energy 100 electron volt. Find it is de Broglie wavelength uh, where C is the velocity of light, okay. I have told you many times these uh, questions are simply formula based, okay. First of all, try to write down the given data. What is given? Mass of the particle. So, you can write down in the solution, mass of particle which is equal to how much? 0 0.5 mega electron volt per c square okay so next what is given kinetic energy 100 electron volt so i can write down here ke kinetic energy which is equal to 100 electron volt but we usually take uh, in terms of joules so conversion is most important one in the problems you should be aware of that so if i have to convert electron volt into joule so you have to multiply the value 1.602 multiplied by 10 raised power minus 19 joules okay this becomes your value in terms of joules if you have to convert the electron volt so this is given find de Broglie wavelength so wavelength is denoted by lambda which we have to calculate okay where c is the velocity this c is the velocity over here velocity of light so i can write down here mass of particle m is equal to 0 0.5 mega electron volt means 10 power 6 i can take down in terms of electron volt simply okay per c square right then i can write down m is equal to 0 0.5 into 10 power 6 sorry 0 0.5 into 10 power 6 if i have to convert electron volt i have told you here you have to multiply with 1.602 into 10 power minus 19 okay this becomes your joule per c square so i will take the value of c over here you know already what is the velocity of light value so this is 0 0.5 into 10 power 6 multiplied by 1.602 10 power minus 19 divided by c square means 3 into 10 power 8 is the velocity of light whole square this becomes your mass so if you will calculate this much m is equal to so let me calculate this much here 0 0.5 multiplied by 10 power 6 into 1.602 into 10 power minus 19 divided by 3 into 10 power 8 whole square which is equal to 8.9 into 10 power 31 8.9 into 10 power minus 31 this becomes your m value okay so now we have the formula over here okay so the formula is lambda is equal to h divided by under root of 2 m e so m is in terms of kg as it is the mass okay so it it is in terms of kg you have to take down which is equal to h h value you know already okay 6.68 is the constant into 10 power minus 34 this is the uh, what we call constant value and you should remember these constant values always so that you will not find any difficulty in the examinations next is under root of 2 times mass how much is the mass 8.9 into 10 power minus 31 okay then uh, energy kinetic energy is how much 100 into 1.602 into 10 power minus 19 okay so when you calculate this much you will get the lambda value accordingly so 6.63 multiplied by 10 power minus 34 right under root of 2 multiplied by 8.9 multiplied by 10 power minus 31 multiplied by 100 multiplied by 1.602 multiplied by 10 power minus 19 minus 19 which is equal to 1.24 so 1 point sorry 1.24 multiplied by 10 raised power minus 10 wavelength is in terms of always meters so this becomes your answer for the wavelength find it is de Broglie wavelength we were supposed to calculate the de Broglie wavelength okay so this is where lambda is equal to 1.24 into 10 power minus 10 meter so only thing is you need to remember the conversion okay how to convert electron volts in into joules and how to convert mega electron volt into electron volt okay simply by multiplying 10 power 6 you are changing the ele uh, mega electron volt into uh, electron volts okay multiplied by this much uh, 1.602 in order to take it in uh, in joules 
okay so rest of the uh, thing is calculation which you can easily do in the calculator over there okay so this much is the solution for this question this is the five or six marks question in the video examinations so you can refer the solution and also try to write down uh, the solution as it is in the video answer booklet okay so all the best for your examinations my dear friends hope you are practicing very well and uh, hope you will clear the subjects in the earlier attempt itself thank you